Yo, today, I'm going to be showing you some fighters gameplay. Now, this is my personal gameplay of some stuff I just wanted to go through and talk about through the day-to-day. -day. There's a special little surprise in one of them. You might know from the title. I'm not sure. You might know from the title, but other than that, let's get right into it. I want to show you these few games that I played. So, essentially, I want to do live streams when it comes to fighters because, you know, What's better than the live experience? I'm not always going to do post commentary for sure. I just had these games lined up for a minute now and I just was able to set it up. So these are games I've been anticipating for a while, but usually I will either live stream it or play live and have the gameplay and all that. Now with this video, whenever this is coming out, I, I think, and there might be an influx of fighters videos. You'll see how much I love this game in a second but i've only been playing for three months so i'm fairly new and if you're if you're shaky about getting into fighters do it bro this game is fucking amazing all right so essentially yeah not to flex but a little bit of flex i'm a pink square see what saying three rank uh hit me up if you ever want to fight i'm down i'm down to even fight people that are way better than me i mean like you got two million bp fight me I'm cool with it. I'm cool with taking a hella L. If you don't know anything about this game, or you, if you don't know anything about Dragon Ball, I mean, if you don't know anything about Dragon Ball, listen to me. Don't let that deter you from the game. I personally, I hate Dragon Ball. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest to say, I don't care. I know this is gonna be targeted towards Dragon Ball fans. I don't like Dragon Ball. But uh, other than that, let's go to the replays. Let's hop right into it so you can see what I, why, why I'm, you know, trying to show this gameplay off a little bit. Now, tell me how you feel about this post-commentary type beat thing. It's not going to be forever, so don't expect me to always do post-commentary if that's your thing. But this is definitely, these aren't the only set of fights I want to show you. There's more, a lot more I've been saving up I want to show you. Over like 100 fights I could show you, probably show you a good 10 out of all those. So, you're going to see an influx of fighters videos. That's something I can't even tell you're not going to see. You're going to see an influx, but uh, match is about to start, so let me shut up. <clears throat> so, immediately we're coming in. Gogeta is a character that... I instantly fell in love with like I've been playing for three months so I came I started playing when baby came out but like I didn't really buy him I wasn't really into the game like that but this was a perfect entry character he's not not entry but like just in general like <laughs> I mean look at him just in general he's just a great character all around type B his zoning is a little off but it's nothing you can't fix with something else now as you'll really see in this game look at the mix I mean the setup I meant to say the setup the setup is something I really like to do. It's something about base Vegeta that's just the sauce, the end of his combos. Like, it's just something about him. Now, I am in the lower rank, so no high-level gameplay would be coming from this. But, decent gameplay, you know. So, my motive here was to kill Gogeta first, of course. I am I was trying to keep... I don't... Wait. When I was playing, I don't think I really cared about the dramatic. But, you see it's there. That, that could possibly happen. I don't know if it happened in this game or not, but... You know, I don't even know if it happened at all, actually. What am I talking about? Now, with one character down, I could get a little bit more cocky, a little bit more aggressive, but I decided to keep it cool, keep it cool. Now, this game was a little bit long ago, so I'm not going to remember everything, but look at that. The level threes. Yikes. I vanished off that. I could have done something better. I don't know, but I had the bar to do it. Me just getting a little aggressive with the sparking. I wanted to keep Vegeta alive. That was terrible. I don't know how he got hit by that slow overhead. But, hey, it is what it is. Down to this last character. <laughs> I love doing that. It's just such a great setup of moves. You, get, you gotta be patient off Oki. You gotta, you gotta block. You gotta take the mix-ups. I got no use for a sand that can't move. Dump all out. I'm getting a little cocky. You get a little cocky. But, you know, it comes with the game. Should be game in a minute. Wow, oh, level threes. Shit looks so good. Starting out with that Gogeta 2M, you know that's like his best move. You have to do it. Uh, with the level one, which is probably the bane, that could have done a lot for him momentum-wise. Tried to 2H me. I kept it simple. 
Finish off with the Dragon Rush level one. <laughs> First game's done. Now, I know what you're probably saying. Wow, you're showing me gameplay of you watching someone. Don't worry. I got the L's in the background. I got the flaws. As you can see, me watching this back, I see a lot of things that I messed up on. I could have done better. And I'm like, damn, I suck. But I'm getting there. I'm getting better. I want you to come along with me in this journey of getting better. I'm already at Super Saiyan 3, so I'm getting there, but I'm not there yet. As you can see, my movement's a little messed up, whatever, but... <sighs> Let's go to the next game. All right, here we go into the next game. Now, there might be a surprise in this one. I'm not sure, maybe, but uh, let's see what happens. Now, when it comes to team building and things like that, uh, look at Globku's, Globku's video. Globku has a great video on team building. It didn't really help me out because I already had my team. When I started playing, I played with base Vegeta and base Goku Gotenks. That was my team. That was it. I wasn't doing anything else. And uh, Lotus Asakura was actually an influence on that. So go check him out. Very great YouTuber. I learned a lot from him. So essentially, on that Lotus and Globku thing, a lot of this game and a lot of fighting games in general is just keep watching content, learning. It helps a lot, a lot. For me to be three months into this game and playing on the same level as some people with a thousand games in, granted, the people with a thousand games are some shit, <laughs> granted, and they're still in my rank, but it's still something that goes to show. The amount of training I put into this game is basically all you need. You just need to keep training. Now, getting hit by that did hurt me a little bit. I remember that hurt me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I saw that got that felt a little personal. You know what I'm saying? It was a little too easy for him. Uh, he let me out. Now, something else I figured out recently. Wow, let me let this combo rock. Is when you're in combos, instead of spamming circle or any button to attack, you could actually just hold it. That was something that like I was like, damn. But yeah, that's a good, good little tip. That record is so good. A lot of people are learning it though. They're learning to block overhead or reflect. Mm, mm. Yeah! The 2M! Now, I do know Gogeta's corner combo. I know that. I've been to it, but I was just like a little. I think I tried it here. No, I didn't. I was a little too like hyped up about this. You'll see. You'll see. I had to get Gogeta out. I was a little hyped up about the dramatic finish. I didn't want to do nothing too crazy. Now you'll see right here, right? I do that so fucking much. I'll level one raw and then to go to my other level one just for the fuck of it, just to catch someone. I did it like once and now I just keep doing it. That was so lucky. That was so lucky. I remember that too. I want to learn Vegeta's ba base Vegeta loops. They're really fucking cool. If I could get that on this content, oh my God. I swear, it's only going to get better from here. On to the next one. Now, you'll see my goal. It's clear. Oh, he did it for me. Shoot, I forgot about that. <laughs> the DP? Was that what I just saw? Mm -mm. I love that combo. It's the only combo I know with Vegeta. I love it. The DP 2H. That's the end of you. Or not. Because I, I suck. Okay. So Rossi is That was meaty. That was meaty. He caught both of them in that shit. Now, I just got one more job to do. He sparked. He tried to hit with the 2M. Wait a minute. Uh, Rekka, he knows what to do. He knows what to do. And I caught him poking on the counter. That was a mutual little respect thing, but I, I masked first. You know what I'm saying? I tried it there. It didn't work out. It didn't work out. That's cool. Fucked up pressing buttons. What's about to happen? Let's go. Yes, sir. That was my first ever dramatic finish in game. That's why I wanted to show this set. I didn't just want to show the one game and then whatever. But that fucking was amazing. I love Arc System Works for even thinking of putting that in the game. Oh my god, she has me so hyped right now. <laughs> I can hop in an online game right now, but nah, this is the post commentary section now. Um, save replays, so essentially, I think in the save replays, the outro stay even if your opponent skipped it, including dramatic finishes, I believe. But shout out to Sonic Destroyer 50 for not skipping it during the actual game. He did not skip it, he sat there and taked it. 
I fucking love this man for that. Thank you, Sonic Destroyer 50. If I can find the at of this man, it'll be in the description. Hopefully I can, but this video is a little too short, so we're gonna keep bonuses. We're gonna go on to the next one. Now, this other one I don't remember as much, so I'm gonna be like hearing and learning as you are, but uh, that team's toxic as fuck. If you weren't all CSs, oh, by the way, I do have to say this. I'm probably saying this like three minutes into the video, two minutes, 10 minutes, I don't know. I'm so sorry, and I understand if you leave this video on dislike and just unsubscribe in general, I would understand. <clears throat> uh, I'm a Wi-Fi warrior. I know, I said it. Look, I, I don't live in my own house. I live all the way upstairs. Look, I can't get a router or whatever. I do, however, have a little Intel thing on my PC, so it's like an extra router. So maybe I'm a good person. I don't know, but uh, let's get back to this match. <laughs> Look at this shit. Now, wait a minute. I'm a little sus right now. Okay, no. I thought he wasn't uh, moving at first, but no. He's just a Broly player. Uh, uh Look at this toxicity. I hate Broly combos. Can we talk about Broly combos real quick? Why do these bitches last so long and do barely less than 3,000 damage? What are we doing? And then he used the CSS to confirm him. At least he's doing that. At least he's not using CSS in neutral. That would fucking kill me. 6M. Can it confirm? I'm an idiot. Nope. Vanish Wars going on. This was a... Uh, like 50 matches before the other one we just watched where I got the dramatic. So this was a long time ago, but uh, I had it favorited, so I don't really remember why, but it's there, so let's just watch it together, I guess. <laughs> okay. Decent movement. Hit him with the EX kick. Can't fuck with the ES kick. That's one of my favorite moves, bruh. Can't fuck with the ES kick. I had to do it. I had to do a kick again. I'm sorry. Toxicity. Now, as you'll see, I think I, I remember this a little bit. He gets a lot less aggressive once he loses Broly. Like, once he loses Broly, he loses his bullets. Like, he no longer has a sniper. He got a pistol now. Like, he, his shit is completely different. He lost his LMG. He lost his ray gun. He went down. He's completely different. Look how fucking... Not lazy. I don't want to say lazy. How... Uh, what's the word? Ah, uh, stutter. Okay. How less aggressive he is is what I meant to say. Super dashes. I'm really uh, being really impatient right now. Mm -mm. Go for the normal BNB. I also know uh, Gogeta's little extra BNB or whatever the thing is, where you know he does his. I think it's two one four L. No, it's the two three six L or triangle. I don't know. Whatever in the air and shit. But <laughs> yeah, I'm getting better at the game for sure. You can see the improvement probably from this game to the last game. If I have enough time, I haven't really been looking at the time, but if I have enough time, I'll show you the other set. But yeah, I had to bring in base Goku. I don't know base Goku's best routes. I'm trying to learn them too with the Kaioken. Either of them, all three. His little Rekka system. Shit. Anchors, man. Anchors. <laughs> Gotta be patient, man. I could button mash too. I think that's game, right? Three meter? If I had Gogeta and I could have done the little, uh, no, nah, I'm not even gonna say nothing about that. That could be saved for later. Same Kaioken! GG's. Game one done into me. On the game two of the set. Yes, sir. Let's see what happens this game. Okay, bad 2H. I don't know why I did that. Fucking Broly. Makes sense. Nah, that was my fault. Definitely my fault. Hate that C assist. To level one, interesting. <clears throat> Let's not talk about that. Hmm. Sparking, keep Vegeta alive. Being a little bit patient. Fucking grabs. Vanish. <sighs> Got a little bit impatient. I could clearly tell. I, I don't like Broly. I really just don't like Broly. So I understand the impatience. I really just wanted to get him killed. But uh, on to Gogeta. I'm, I'm surprised I didn't round start Lariat. That's usually my way to go. Uh, right there. I know what to do off the 6M. Uh, 6M confirm, right? That's what it is. That's 6M. His Rekka. I know what to do after that. You're supposed to Super Dash and then 2, 3, 6H. Uh, medium, but uh, yeah, I never put that to fruition. I'm not gonna lie. I trained and did it, but even then, like, that was me trying to set up the corner combo and I fucked it up. But it is what it is. See the lariat coming out, 
he had to stop me that much. Did not expect that one. Yep, he got hit by the lariat. <laughs> <laughs> See, the round star layers are coming out. The round star layers are coming out, bro. Uh, random dash two H's. My dumbass. All right, we're down to a base Goku. Now, one thing I aspire to do is learn more base Goku colors, learn more base Goku combos. But it's it's hard. His combos have hella delays in them. His corner combo, I tried to learn it a bit. The delays, it's a lot harder for me. Especially because I'm a Wi-Fi warrior, but let's not talk about that. That's not what we're here to talk about, all right? But uh, I learned three combos with him. I learned the, the JS extension, this Vanish extension, and his normal BNB, of course. I gotta learn his his uh, Kaioken too, to make it look a lot more cleaner and get more optimal damage. But at least I know how to count like seven, like two seven, unlike most Dragon Ball fans. Wait, I'm not a Dragon Ball fan though, so don't 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 do that to me. Look at that, pressing buttons. That was a smart match though. He should've just done it earlier. Should've committed. Now we're down to Anchor versus Anchor. He has Sparking 5 meter. It's gonna be a rough one for me, but uh, let's see how I fare. Already get me. Dropped me down, decided to spend his Sparking. Level three, get as much damage as he can, I'm assuming. Sheesh. Bang. Fucked me up, bro. I did not know Beerus had that shit in his kit, bro. That fucked me up. I was like, damn. I know if I had that knowledge, I would have fucking punished the hell out of that. But uh, that's game two going to our opponent. I'm not saying his name, and we're all uh, they're Dragon Ball fans, so you could uh, think of the degeneracy in their name. <clears throat> all right, last game in this set. Now, uh, I'm pretty sure I have some online games with Videl. I'm not sure if I ever lose. Not to be cocky, I don't mean that like that, but I, I want to show you sets where it's actually fair and fun and not just me wha whooping someone, uh, unless I'm getting a dramatic finish, which I'm not going to say I whooped him, but hey, that's up to y'all, but uh, I got Videl. One thing I got to do in more of my games is I have to do the combos I know. I don't really do the JS extension, although I know it. I'm not that great at it because of the delay, but I know it, and Gogeta's, his personal BNB where he does the two, three, six medium after doing like his little stuff i don't use that i don't do his corner combos as much as i should too but i know it but uh <clears throat> watch broly fucking molly -wop me fucking stomps mm -hmm. long ass combos oh, i hit it here oh by the way he didn't do it there but uh you can hold dragon rushes that's something i recently learned fucking 2h you can hold dragon rushes so do that when you Dragon Rush hold it, it gives you more damage. Like right there, I knew the combo, I just didn't do it. I'm not sure if I was playing it safe or I'm just like, I just wasn't too confident in it, but uh, I'm definitely gonna put it to fruition a lot more. Damn, I could have comboed off that, huh? The Dragon, see, I didn't hold it, I could have got a lot more damage. Probably could have killed. If I didn't drop that, I probably could have killed. Oh yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> yes sir i hit it with the level three that that was funny as fuck to me bro i was laughing my ass off so essentially what happened was you know the level one little stun thing after doing it didn't go off so i could still switch over and he didn't know that so he probably pressed the button got him with the level three kill broly <laughs> that's what that's why you saw earlier when i did that i was trying to do that but uh on a different scale because vegeta decided to miss but that's okay one 2v2, Gogeta versus uh, Goku, SSG, SSS. Try to hit my lariats. I don't remember if I said this or not, but uh, learn block strings. Learn learn block strings. They're very important. Something I need to put to fruition and start learning is block strings because all I do is that bullshit record every time. People are going to, ooh, the cross up. People are going to end up learning that. Oh, is this where I go for the combo? Mm, 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 mm. Oh, the super dash fucked up. Oh, I was looking forward to that. And then I get hit with an overhead. That's some, that's rude. That was rude. You didn't have to do that. Okay, he dropped it. Interesting. 2H my vanish. That's stupid vanish. It's good 2H on his part, though. Not a lot of people react to it, but. Okay. Do I get Goku back in? I think I did. 
Okay, yeah. You're... You're plus off vanish. I, I I believe you're plus off vanish. So if someone vanishes, don't press buttons. Just keep blocking. Unless you unless you got a DP. DP. Go ahead. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> yes, sir. I forgot about that. That's why I say these clips. His ass vanished into the <laughs> toxic. That's toxic as hell. Oh my god. I remember that shit. That shit was funny as hell. He vanished into the, the fucking spirit bomb and I won the game. I imagine how pissed he must have been at that. That's funny as hell, bruh. Joy, this is not the end of the fighter saga. This will keep on going. It's probably going to take over my channel for a bit. This is one of my favorite games of all time. And I've just started three months ago. If you haven't, if you're on the fence about getting fighters, get the game, man. This game is so fucking good. The community is good. All of that. If you want some shout outs to people you should watch. I got some. Go watch Dado Doya for sure. Watch the Three Idiot series. That's with C Rex, um, Rhyme Style, and Dado Doya himself. Uh, Lotus Asakura. I watch him a lot. And if you want to watch a more beginner on my level type beat, watch some of Afro Century's videos. He he's all right. You know what I'm saying? He's on my level. So yeah, go watch that. But uh, other than that, that's not the end of Fighters videos. Subscribe, all that. If you want to keep updated to it, I'll see you in the next one. See you later. Or the outro.